Okay, this is going to be a quick, easy one. Have you ever had the situation where you're working with images in Premiere Pro and maybe you're creating a slideshow or something, and when you drag the picture on the timeline, it plays too long. So for example, let's drag this one on here that I just did. And it's just a motorcycle, but the amount of time that it's on the screen just feels very long and you want to make it shorter. You can, of course, select it, right click, speed duration, and then adjust it here to make it you know, display for whatever time frame that you want to display. And now it's gone. But when you put the next image on here, that's going to stay at that default length. So the trick here is you want to select all of them. So these are all of the images that I'm working with that I want to put into the slideshow. I select all of them. And now I right click, select speed duration, and I want to reduce it, so I'm just going to drag it to the right, or you can click into it and just manually change the number. So yeah, let's say I want them to show for, there we go, 15, hit OK, and now drag and drop them into your timeline. And notice what it does is it takes all of them and puts them at that 0.15 second. Voila, and that's really all there is to this. Um, it's so much easier than doing the uh, other method of dragging it out, dropping it, shorten it, all of that kind of stuff. Now let's say you don't want to necessarily have to grab it every time and change it like that. You can change the general default of how long a still image plays as well. So if you go to Edit, Preferences, and then it's under timeline. It used to be under general, but they've moved it with the late, uh, I don't know, latest version or previous version. But anyway, it's under timeline. So under timeline, you have this option of still image default duration. And you can see it defaults to five seconds. But in my case, I wanted it to default to something quicker. So let's go 0 0.20 seconds. And then just hit OK. And now the default duration going forward will be set at that 0 0.20 second versus the five second that it was set up for. So that's two ways that you can do this, change your default into it, or do the select all and drag that into your timeline. As always, feel free to comment or leave some kind of feedback and we might get back to you on it.